Hi, everyone. Welcome back to the Cross Training Women Weekly Live. I'm Allie, Christian Health and Fitness Coach and the founder of Cross Training Women, where I help women transform their body and health biblically so that they can live full and abundantly and carry out their God-given purpose. Today, I want to talk about one of the most common causes of binge eating. Do you ever struggle with this? Do you ever find yourself eating large quantities of food in a short period of time or just feel out of control around food? Well, if you struggle with this, chances are you're doing this one thing and it's keeping you in this vicious cycle of binge eating. And that one thing is you are restricting. When you restrict your calories, you are setting yourself up for a binge. Why? Well, God wired our brains for survival and restriction is perceived by the body as being in a famine. And to prevent starving to death, our brain signals our body to seek out food and to in order to restore the nutrients and calories that it needs to survive and, and properly fun and function properly. And so these signals to your brain that it sends, like raising your hunger hormone ghrelin, makes it very difficult to fight and to ignore these signals telling you that you're hungry and eat more food. And so eventually you give in and you binge. And then what happens is you feel guilty or ashamed for eating so much food that you decide to restrict your calories again. And then it just goes in this vicious cycle of restricting and binging. And if that sounds familiar to you, then really what you need to focus on and address is not binge eating, but rather the root cause, which is restriction. And so really the question you need to ask is why can't I stop restricting? Well, most likely you're restricting because you wanna lose weight or at the very least maintain your weight. You don't wanna gain weight. In fact, maybe you're afraid to gain weight because we live in this culture that obsesses over thinness and that message that we've been given, especially by diet culture, is that in order to achieve this ideal body of thinness, then we need to diet, we need to restrict. We need to restrict our calories and our food because that's how you lose weight and achieve the ideal body. And so as a result, we become afraid of food and afraid of calories and big portions, and we're overly concerned about overeating, and so we restrict. And so we can do this for a little while. We can restrict our calories and our portion sizes, and we can kind of muster up the strength and motivation to do it for a period of time. And it works to some degree. We might lose some weight. And so we think that this is the key, that everyone who's thin, they just must be able to, to successfully do this long term. And if I just keep trying this, then eventually I'll always be able to do it as well. And so you keep trying, but this is just a trap. It's never going to work, at least not long term, because like I said, you're your brain and your body will fight back and eventually you'll binge. And so restricting is not the answer to losing and maintaining weight long term. You don't need to, nor should you restrict your calories and, and starve yourself to lose weight. Instead of restricting, my mantra is to replace, not restrict. So replace all of the high calorie, high fat, high sugar foods, the foods that are eaten on the standard American diet, including things like meat and eggs and dairy and all of the processed junk food like chips and candy and, and cookies with low fat, low calorie, whole plant-based foods. And when you, you do that, when you replace the food you're eating with whole plant-based foods, then you can stop restricting because you can actually eat a large volume of food that keeps you full and satisfied without racking in the calories. And so it's very easy to lose and maintain your weight. And because you fill up on so much food during the day, you don't at the end of the night experience all these extreme hunger pains or cravings because you've, you're have you already content and you've satisfied your calorie and nutrient requirements. And so your brain shuts off or it reduces your hunger drive. And so it stops this vicious binge restrict cycle. So that's one of the things that I love most about eating a whole foods plant-based diet is I never have to worry about calories or portion sizes. I can eat freely until I'm full and satisfied and you, you don't get caught up in this vicious binge restrict cycle. Okay, so let me know in the comments if this was a mindset shift for you that you've been so focused on the binge aspect and not addressing the real issue, which is restriction. And if you wanna learn more about how to properly nourish your body so that you can easily lose and maintain your weight, while at the same time achieve optimal health, then send me a message. I would love to chat further with you. But thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I will see you guys back here next Tuesday. Bye.